guys. Um, so I got home last night from my trip to Nevada for like three weeks. And uh, it was a good trip. Actually, the first time ever that I have taken a bus and a train and been on both. <laughs> Every other year, it seems like my train runs late, so I miss my bus, whatever. Um, hold on, ESPN just alerted me something. Uh. Darn. <laughs> Patriots go to the next round. Um, that was unneeded information. <laughs> But I got home last night, probably around like 6.30 or so, and uh, I get home to find out that my car battery has been dead for probably about like a week and a half, maybe three weeks. Um, I had a call to AAA today, and I had put a brand new battery in my car. Wasn't very happy about it. Um, had asked my grandma to pay for it because I don't have any money yet. <laughs> my grant is still not in. Uh... And yeah, that was really kind of irritating. Ask simple questions. Have my car started once a week. Don't kill it. <laughs> Didn't happen. Um, let's see. What else? Oh, and apparently there's been a whole bunch of drama going on like regarding certain situations. I'm just like, heh. This is why I left. <laughs> but on a brighter note, I guess. Kind of brighter. Um, <laughs> back home kind of freezing my buns off. My house had no heater on for three weeks and I have concrete floors. So I've basically been under blankets for the past night and day. <laughs> um, I'm stoked that the 49ers beat the Packers last night and they get to play Atlanta, which I'm even more excited about because last time we played the Seahawks, <laughs> we got our butts handed to us, which I don't want that to happen again. So I'm glad it's not the Seahawks play against us. Um, Kaepernick did amazing. My Nevada boy, I gotta support him. Uh, I was stoked. I didn't get to watch it, but I was listening to it the whole time and had GameCast on my phone. <laughs> All sorts of fun stuff. Um, oh, bright news. Uh, I talked to a public relations person from the Reno Aces on, a uh, on Friday and they don't hire until November, December area. But she gave me a whole bunch of news, like what I need to do to get to working for one of those organizations and stuff like that. And uh, she looked over my resume and stuff and she's like, yeah, this is really good. Like you have a lot of skills that people look for and stuff like that. Um, I made the executive decision and I texted my boss this the day after the day, like that day that I got done talking to the Aces, and I texted her, she's like, hey, so, you have me for summer. She's all sorts of excited. She told me I have to call Pat, who was my other boss, um, on Monday, and tell her that I'm coming back for summer. Uh, I have to look for apartments up in Marysville still. So, we'll see how that goes. Uh, what else? Oh, I have knee surgery Tuesday, so this is probably going to be my last vlog for at least, like, a week and a half, maybe... Maybe a little longer than that. I'm not 100% sure yet. Um, but yeah, school starts soon. It starts, I think, the 28th. Hopefully I have my grant by then so I can actually buy my books and all the stuff I need for school because if not, I'm going to have to borrow more money from family members and stuff. <laughs> kind of sucks, but I guess that's life of a college student. But I guess that's going to be really it for now. Oh, wait, just kidding. <laughs> One... One more thing, um, this video right here, it's gonna be in between my fingers, right here, um, is One Direction's video for Kiss Me, or Kiss You, Kiss You, excuse me, not Kiss Me, um, <laughs> cracks me up every time I watch it, I actually really like the song too, I know I'm becoming a Directioner, sorry guys, I'm sharing all these One Direction videos with you, <laughs> um, but anyways, I'll talk to you guys soon, and if not, it'll be a couple weeks. Bye, guys. I'll see you hopefully way soon.